Hello everybody, this is Michael Smiley coming at you with another review video. Um, today I want to talk about Bohemian Rhapsody. So, I'm a huge Queen fan, and obviously millions of other people are around the world, and um, I saw this movie like five times, you know, when it first came out, and it just got better and better with each view. I think that they did an extremely incredible job. Um, especially when it comes to like um, biographical uh, movies. And I like how um, you know the acting was superb, the, the pacing of it. I really do think that they did an excellent job. I really love the whole Live 8 concert at the end. Um, yeah, this movie deserved every award that it got. It really did. Um, and it's really crazy how close they got, like, the band members to look to the original band. Um, that was pretty awesome. Uh, I did not know some things. I mean, I'm not a diehard uh, Queen fan, but I am a fan of their music. Um, I just didn't follow them, but I love their music. But I have a whole new um, respect and outlook on um, the band now because, it, like, I, I loved everything about the movie. And I think that they did an awesome job, and um, it was really cool to see the original um, band members up in the rafters or whatever the, it, it was um, in the Live 8 con during the Live 8 concert when they were doing that. <clears throat> and, oh man, didn't win enough Academy Awards. Uh, it was... It was so good, guys. So, if you haven't checked out Bohemian Rhapsody, oh, and another thing. So, I love the actor Mike Myers. Um, obviously, he's the one that played in uh, Wayne's World and um, Austin Power, the Austin Powers trilogy. Um, so it was so hysterical to see him. Um, you know, against the Queen Band, because he was, like, the record executive, whatever it was there, and, um, yeah, it was, it was hysterical with, um, how he had portrayed his character and everything. Because he was still hilarious, even though he wasn't trying to be. And I'm sure that the real-life person that he was portraying was really a douchebag. But it's Mike Meyer, so... I mean, you just can't hate him. Um, yeah. Uh, like I said, it, it, it flowed really smoothly. And it really portrayed the band members quite excellently, and, um, yeah. Freddie Mercury had a wild life. Um, and it was a roller coaster ride, uh, but he was bold, he was, he was risky, he was, um, he really didn't care. I mean, he did care. But he didn't. Um, he had passion and love for what he did, but he just didn't care how other people felt about it. Um, he was bold. Um, but anyway, guys, uh, let me know what you guys think about Bohemian Rhapsody down in the comment section. Um, and let me know what your thoughts and stuff on that was. Uh, I thought it was an excellent movie. It was one of, I don't even really like um, musical, biographical type of movies like that. Um, 
it's either hit or miss for me. Either I really like the movie or I really don't. Um, but Bohemian Rhapsody is one of my all-time favorite movies, and I could watch it over and over and over and over. Um, it was an excellent movie. Um, it was hilarious at points. It was serious at points. It was sad. It was um, tragic. It was beautiful. All, all in the same movie. It was like a whole combination of everything. So, if you haven't watched it, check it out. Uh, make sure that you subscribe to my channel, uh, like this video, and comment below, and let me know what you think about the movie. Okay? Until later, guys.